हेलो चिल्ड्रन टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू स्टार्ट विद आर न्यू चैप्टर चैप्टर 11 फंडामेंटल कंसेप्ट ऑफ ज्योमेट्री बिफोर स्टार्टिंग दिस चैप्टर फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल फ्यू डेफिनेशन फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल पॉइंट व्हाट इज अ पॉइंट अ पॉइंट इज अ मार्क ऑफ पोजिशन दैट हैज एन एग्जैक्ट लोकेशन अ पॉइंट विल हैव ए एग्जैक्ट लोकेशन इट हैज नो लेंथ नो ब्रेथ नो थिकनेस एंड इट इज ऑलवेज नोटेड बाय अ डॉट दिस इज अ पॉइंट नेक्स्ट इज लाइन when a number of points are joined together they will form a line when the number of points are joined together they will form a line line you can extend on both the sides indefinitely next is ray a ray is a straight path which can be extended indefinitely only in one direction from one direction you can't increase you can't extend it but from the other direction you can extend it indefinitely line segment when line segment will come it will have a definite length a line segment is a straight path which has a definite length its definite its length will be definite and we can measure it next is surface now the surface has length and width but no thickness a surface will have a length and breadth width means breadth but it will not have a thickness a surface may be a flat or curve it may be curved like the surface of the apple it may be curved but the surface of this tablet is a plane surface next is plane plane is a smooth flat surface gives us an idea of a plane like this square it is a plane surface rectangle plane triangle plane surface circle plane surface you can say all the 2d figures will be a plane surface next is intersecting lines when the two lines are intersecting or we can in easy language we can say are cutting each other when the two lines are cutting each other it is known as the intersecting lines in the case of caesar you can see the intersecting point will be there next is parallel lines parallel line means the lines which will not meet you can extend that lines but they will not meet anywhere so these lines are known as the parallel lines next is collinear points collinear points means that two or more points lying on the same plane or lying on the same straight line two or more points lying on the same straight line they are known as the collinear points concurrent lines three or more lines passing through one point three or more lines passing through one point they are known as the concurrent lines next is exercise 11.1 you can do this exercise in your book only state true or false first question is state true or false a line has no end point so that is correct line has no end point we can extend the line both the sides a ray has definite length false one side it is definite but other side we can extend so it is false a line segment has one end point false a line segment has two end points you can measure it a line segment can be drawn on a piece of paper yes you can draw it on a piece of a paper two lines in a plane always intersect each other if there are two lines in a plane always they will intersect no they can also be the parallel lines so it is false three points lie on the same line can be said to be collinear yes three or more points lying on a same straight line are known as the collinear so it is true a point has no length and width that we have done very first that a point has no length and no breadth it is true fill in the blanks a line segment has dash end points so how many end points two a point is denoted by dot you can draw this also the point which lie on the same line are called collinear points the lines which do not intersect each other and have equal distance at every point are called parallel they which they do not intersect each other so these are the parallel lines a surface has length yes and breadth but no thickness no thickness a line segment has definite length a ray does not have definite length it will not have a definite length next 
check whether the following points are collinear or not from here you have to see which which points are collinear so better to draw a straight line passing through a b and c and b d and e only this lines we can draw so a b c yes it is a collinear d e a d e and a no they are not collinear not collinear b c d b c d not collinear it is sorry it is b c and d not collinear c e b c e and b not collinear and b d e b d e they are collinear lying on the same straight line identify the examples of a point a line segment or a plane now examples are given to you you have to check whether they are the examples of point line segment or a plane sheet of a paper plane a small dot point surface of a floor plane an led screen plane sides of a rectangle line segment write how many lines can be drawn through a given point a given point how many lines we can draw indefinite so infinite lines will be there from two given points from two given points you can draw only one line three non collinear points three non collinear points are there can you draw a line no so none collinear points if the black points are lying on a same straight line so only one line we can draw last question of this exercise state whether the following pair of lines or rays appear to be parallel or intersecting very easy so if i will extend these lines they will intersect at a point these are the intersecting lines they will not intersect so these are the parallel lines they will also intersect these are the intersecting lines and last one will be your they will not intersect these are your parallel lines so children in this video this much only next video we will do the next exercise